For those just joining us, I am Freak alongside JJ Babrams. We are your casters for the day, and we've got a nail biter going on in the semifinal round of the third annual Tales of Titans Winter Classic presented by Noob Lube. Knuckle oil for the novice gamer. Noob Lube. Get lubed, you noob. Freak, nobody expected this. Underdog Sorcerer is giving top ranked Toxic Shock a run for their money. More specifically, that $100,000 top prize. Sorcerer is your classic ragtag bunch. There's Ant Girl, one of the few female players on the tournament scene. I've got top. Blake, come with me. Sauce go mid with Dave. Dave Fu has really emerged as a premier support player. Rock and roll, Ant Girl. So cool to be working under a powerful woman. There's Cosmonaut, who's, I don't know, he's Russian, I guess. There's Sauce, who speaks softly but carries a big mouse. Go. Sorcerer's star carry is 17-year-old veteran Wake and Blake. He seems visibly nervous. And he's got a reason to be. He's up against Toxic Shock, the best team in the world. They're led by two-time Gamer of the Year, Chad Pussy. And here's Rocktopus flanking around the back right now. They don't see him coming, and they're not even reacting in time. He's getting his hits in for free. Cosmonaut, guard the keep. Blake, where are you? I'm all alone out here, come on. Oh, it seems like Wake and Blake is frozen up. This is the most pressure some of these players have ever been under. Blake! There is no other way to put this. He is losing his shit. The pressure has really gotten to him, but Toxic Shock is not letting up. <laughs> that is a lot of puke. It looks like someone's <laughs> pregame meal is Arby's. <laughs> I'm receiving word Arby's is a tournament sponsor. Our apologies to the Arby's Corporation. Arby's, we have the meats. I did die of the Titan, didn't tear the Titans in it. I'd come on in the body. Ah, yeah, ah, 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 Red! Red! G -G! G -G! G -G! G -G! G -G! he's beating off. Hey, hey, stop it. Stop hey, it. hey, hey, stop hey. It. Yo, sit down. Should have used all that energy out there. Oh. Now, I've had some big losses in my life. But that shit out there was humiliating. I mean, that was so bad. However, where was I going? I don't understand what just happened. Well, there's no reason to dwell on it, all right? He's dead. We got to keep it moving. What the fuck? Blake's dead? I don't know. Anybody have his parents' number? I do. I'll text them that their son is probably dead. Look, this is all I'm saying. When I retired from the NBA and when I founded this team, it was strictly just to make money. I never thought that one day that I would care for you guys. And I still don't care for you guys. I just see the potential of making so much fucking money on this platform. So we got to move forward, all right? First things first. Um, girl, you're the new player coach. Oh, wow. Definitely. Thank you, Mr. Squibb. Look, I just want to say, Sit I down. feel like... Sit down, whatever. Gonna... No one wants to hear all that. Okay, second thing is we need a replacement. Anyway, I got to go have a meeting with the programmers. They're making me an in-house barbershop app. Why am I telling you? Replacement fast. Yo, this is Squib. Don't fuck with me. Oh! <laughs> Sorry for the freak out of the century, team. Dorkserer. <laughs> this is a team meeting, Chad. Get your fedora and your dumb fuck sycophants out of here. It's a pork pie, not a fedora, you idiot! Fuck you, team horser! Chad pussy! Chad pussy! Oh! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> fuck him. Look, you guys, Squib is right, okay? We've got 12 weeks until the spring championships. We need a new teammate fast. What about me? Shut up, alt trash. You're the alternate. If you played, we wouldn't have an alternate. Yes, sir. Well, all the other top players are already signed to other teams. Not all of them. Di Fieri's a free agent. Plus, I saw on Reddit there's some unknown casual who keeps finishing in the top five in the North American leaderboards. 
Who the hell's Blues Traveler 2112? <sighs> Another bonkers day. I asked Steve, I said, Steve, did you eat my Nutella? And Steve says, no way, you dumb bee. Only he didn't say B. Uh huh. He says the B word. Bitch. That's inappropriate, isn't it? <clears throat> that is total crap. Thank you. <laughs> uh. I'm gonna go get Steve some harsh words. <laughs> Thanks, Greg. You got it, Evan. Greg, my man. Hey, hey what's boss. What's poppin'? Not too much. Oh, did you get that um, word doc that I put together about improving office morale? Uh, yeah, it's dynamite. Look, I need you to fire Anna today, OK? She's just not fitting in with the corporate culture. Oh, ah, uh, gosh, I hate firing people. How about I just coach her on some areas which she can improve Sorry, upon? Sorry, Greg, no dice. You know how it works here at Coleman Schweitzer. One strike and you're out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You wanted to see me? I brought my parking pass like you asked. Hey, Anna! Greg's gonna take care of you right now, oh, okay? okay? She's so nice. Would you like a homemade pecan sandy? Oh, hey. Almost done for the night. You working late, Greg? Uh, yeah, yeah. It's very late <laughs> again. No worries. I got you covered. I like the elevator and set the alarm. Get a good night's sleep. Thanks, man. You're the best. <laughs> you. Good night. Oh, good night. Yeah. And after I graduate high school, I can focus on this team full time. He's perfect. I know. He's he's perfect. So we have to go with him. We have to go with him. Dude, he's still listening. He's, he's right okay. there. Okay. 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 That's dope. All right. Thanks, Di Fieri. We'll be in touch. Yeah. OK, one interview left. You should be here in 15. Greg Davison. Uh, hi. Am I in the right place? I don't know. Are you Blues Traveler 2112's dad? Oh, no. I am him. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm late. Um, traffic from Irvine up to LA was brutal. You're 15 minutes early. A half hour early is on time. On time is late, and late is dead. A little HR humor. <clears throat> this is my resume. Great. OK, come in. I should say I'm not fluent in Spanish. Uh, I habla, but uh, as you can see, um, I graduated from Pepperdine. Um, I've been a human resources associate in Coleman Schweizer for six years. Uh, I'm a real people person. <laughs> this guy knows what I'm talking about. Um, may I ask what position is open in your firm? We're sorcerer. An esports team? Beg your pardon? Tales of Titans. We play it professionally. Is this one of those Ashton Kutcher's? Competitive video gaming is huge. Like, millions of people watch it. How did you get to the top of the leaderboard? Uh, well, I've always been good at video games, and Tales of Titans was something that I could play in my downtime at work. 
you know, my downtime at home, post-divorce and, and pre-divorce. May have contributed to the divorce. You're already divorced? How fucking old are you? Well, I am 33, uh, 34 in April. The fuck? Yes. Look at him. Dude's as old as old Han Solo. I'll have Tommy Squibb's assistant prep an offer to die Fieri. Bye. Bye. Hey, Gregster. Hi. I got another. I need you to take care of for me, okay, buddy? Oh, man. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I have the stomach for another firing. Uh, who? Eduardo the janitor. Apparently, he's been letting a hobo sleep in the offices. Well, I mean, well, maybe the hobo got kicked out of his ex-wife's condo and was sick of sleeping in his Toyota Sienna. God damn it, Greg. Don't rationalize on behalf of a hobo. Just fire this asshole. Eduardo! No, 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 Oh, so good to see you. Greg's gonna take care of you right now, okay? Thank you. Good morning. So what's up? What do you mean you signed with Toxic Shock? They already have a full roster. They're paying you not to play? Just to keep you off our team, okay. You know what? Tell Chad Pussy he's a pussy! I take it it didn't go great. Chad poached I theory. We gotta go with our backup, Blues Traveler. Look, Becca, as a male feminist, I trust your leadership, but that guy's almost 40. What if he has type two diabetes or Alzheimer's or the Black Plague? We don't have another choice, okay? Guys, I've been practicing. Shut, Shut up, all trash! trash. <gasps> Fine. But if you're gonna be a team captain, you're gonna take the fall when he has a heart attack or says something folksy and racist or his bones melt or whatever. <sighs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. That's so sad. Oh, God. <clears throat> this is Greg. Uh, hi, Greg. It's Becca from Team Sorcerer. Are you crying? No. Uh, yes, maybe. I, I just, I just had to fire my best friend. Okay. Anyway, um, we would love for you to come play for Team Sorcerer. Starting stipend is one k per week. Plus bonuses for tournaments. What? That's more than I make. Plus your own room included. A place to live. It's not my office or a minivan filled with bottles of my own urine. Okay. Yeah, m maybe this was a mistake. No, you know what? I'm in. And I am not giving you the runaround. Hey, boss. Hmm. You know that expression, you can't fire me because I quit? Mm -hmm. Well, you can't make me fire anyone else because I'm firing myself. You quit? Yes. Say that next time. Yeah, I could have so said. much quicker. So. Do you want this door open or close? Close, please. Okay. Quicker. Play. Also, am I good to park out front, or should I pull into the driveway? Well, just because the signs were a little confusing, and I don't want to get a parking ticket right now. 